Hi, Roman here from the Music Transcriber. Today we're looking at our new contact instrument, TMT Nobo, version one. This is a hybrid scoring instrument built in collaboration with Miratone Studios in New York City. Using primarily pristine recorded oboes through world-class outboard gear to achieve a hybrid sound that is made for the scoring composer. It has been many years in the making, particularly because it was built on the job during real scoring and producing projects and has been heard in countless commercials and films. There are unique samples for every velocity, for every note that is within the oboe's range. Below that, the lowest sample has been stretched to give the instrument a very unique hybrid low end. Additionally, because the oboe was recorded through a custom chain of outboard delay and reverb, the samples themselves are quite long and have a wonderful evolutionary tail. In addition to this, there are built-in reverb and delay controls using a custom impulse response to give them even more character. Aside from the reverb and delay controls, the ADHSR controls allow you to sculpt this into a more pointillistic instrument through short attack times, or conversely, to help you build a more impressionistic texture through longer ADHSR times. And perhaps one of the most expressive controls is the cutoff frequency, which is mapped to the mod wheel to help you fade in and out of cues and act as a general expression control. Finally, the plugin has a rhythm section, which depending on your settings can act more like an arpeggiator or more like an evolutionary pulse. It has all of the settings that you would expect from a contact sequencer, but when using this source material, it will create soundscapes that are rather unique to the instrument. To keep this video short and sweet, let's play a few different concepts through this scoring instrument. I'm not a fan of watching contact instrument demos that include additional sounds that you won't be getting with your purchase. Additionally, there are no other mixing plugins on this. It is entirely the sound of this instrument, how the samples have been recorded and processed, along with the controls that have been coded into the plugin. So here is Nobo in action all on its own. Let's play through a few chords and a few different settings. Here's uh, the default sound when you load up the instrument. You can see here, I'm just holding one C minor chord, add nine. Slightly higher in velocity. And right now the rhythm arp is on. It's acting as a pulse engine. Let's try it. A slightly harder velocity even again. Great, so you can get a sense of the ambience, the underscoring we can do with this just on its default setting, playing two chords. Uh, I'll go ahead and I will lower the attack time. So it'll be a much faster attack, as you can hear. Um, let's dial back some of that reverb. Let's turn up the rate of the ARP. Let's make it real fast. Get some bass pulsing going. So I'll jump down an octave here. Let's get rid of that delay as well. So you can just hear the pulse. Let's go ahead and do something a little crazier. Right now I got it going two octaves, but we can go down and just keep it in the octave it's played at for those nice scoring bass arps. wheel to control the cutoff up here. We'll fade out of it. Great, so I'm going to take off the art mode here and just show you what the instrument sounds like when used as simply a pad. Thank you. 
Although with the pads, I really like a much longer attack time, much longer hold. Let's go even longer. Let's turn that reverb delay back on here. I'll go back up an octave or two. That was just one chord being held with the impulse response plane. Let's see what that's like with the art bond. All right. Go back to something a little slower. Change the pattern. Give it two octaves. See how that feels. Let's change keys here, D minor. bring back some attack for the ARP for our last example here. Thanks for watching everybody. If you'd like to purchase this, you can check out the link in the description or you can visit themusictranscriber.com or mirrortone.com.